do is you want to make those uh, pre-snap you know choices. You want to get lined up right. You don't want missed assignments, right. missed tackles. Did you do that? Yeah, I mean, for the most part, yeah, but like I said, there's still so much I can get right. better at and be cleaner and, you know, uh, you know, do things, you know, more sharp. You know, it, it, it can take literally a half a step or a half of an alignment to really get you beat, you know, because everything happens so fast. I'm just, I'm just excited and happy to be here. What do you, do you think about the amount of time you had your hand in the dirt? sort of moved around a bit. Were you cool with that? Yeah, I mean, it, it, was, it was good for me, you know, because I, it was something that I also did when I was at UConn, so right. I'm not very unfamiliar to it. Uh, you know, it's just, a, it's just a situation where, you know, you have to work, you know, hard, because now, you know, you're going to get who are really, you know, good. Is, in being in your first game, you've never said for this, you know, league or anything was too big for you, but finally playing your first pro game and there's so much that's expected of you, is it all still going pretty natural or did you have some jitters early? Uh, you know, the first play I was kind of, I was in a surreal moment, right. you know what I mean, and, but after a while, you know, got to play ball. How much, how much did it help getting in there and getting that sack early on? Man, it, it just helped being being able to play, man, I'll tell you the honest truth, and everything else happened how it did, you know, Mike Jenkins came up to me before the game, he was like, you know, just alignment, you know, your assignment, and then the rest of it, you know, happened as it comes, so I was just, I was excited to be out there with the guys. It seemed like you were really into it with the crowd, too, you know, pumping them up a little bit there. How yeah, I, was, I, had, I had a little fun with them, they had, they had some music going, and, uh, you know, it was good to interact with them, and, uh, you know, try to come up with big plays, you know, it's, 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 it's crazy when they get loud, and I love it. Do you like the fact that so much is being asked of you so early that you're coming in and I mean, uh, it, it, it's, 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 it's great to me, you know, because it just lets me know that the coaches, you know, they want to be able to put me in position. And, you know, I want, my biggest thing is I want them to, you know, be able to trust me and, as well as, you know, the bigger thing is for the teammates to trust me as well. You know, I just want to work to give it all I have. Uh, it, feels, it feels, it's way more relieving, you know, uh, to go against another team. You know, I, I enjoyed it. You know, now we got a bigger one next week you know, coming up. And we just have to keep continuing to build the team. What about the speed of the NFL? It's fast. You know, like I was just saying a second ago, you know, half half of an alignment that's wrong or half a step late, you know, can get you beat you know, and put you out of position. So, while you know, going back and watching the film and being able to, you know, see what I can fix, change, and uh, you know, that way I can put myself in a better position for the team. They used you a lot with your action, with your hand on the ground, like as a defensive end, almost, you know, like a traditional defensive end at, at what, 240, whatever you are. The other guy across you probably outweighs you by 60 at least. So what, how, how do you get the better of those kind of situations? Uh, you know, just really fundamentals and technique, man. Uh, I'd say having good hands. You know, being able to play with strong hands, uh, it really really makes a difference. You know, that's something that uh, a lot of the older guys, Dre, uh, Lamar, a lot of the older guys, they, they've been working on with me, you know, day in and day out, just being able to play with strong hands. Sorry, Gary, to mention something, but rather than beginning the game, you could tell you were really fired up. I mean, like, you, you came out on the, on, the, on the return team, you're already, like, rearing to go, and then really early on, you get your sack. I mean, do you, when you get that pumped up and that amped up, do you almost have to, like, calm yourself down? No, I just think you got to hit the game with that same that same pace. You really got to keep yourself high. You know, I'm, I'm a, I play with a lot of emotions, and uh, I really try to lay it out there on the line when I go out there and play. And, you know, that's the same thing you're going to get out of me. You know, just play. That's how I try to play the game.